Welcome back to Zama Jack. Today we've got Infectinator Survivors. This is available for ten forty nine Canadian on Steam. So probably like nine ninety nine American, maybe nine forty nine. Uh, we're gonna hop into campaign mode. New game. I have no idea what this is about. It's supposed to be like a roguelike RTS, like um, survival thing. Um, so you kind of got uh, you got your characters. They have their stats, and I guess you can find things that up their stats or uh, whatever as we go along. So yeah, I don't know. It it, uh, it seems interesting enough to say the least. The car slows down to a halt. So there's no more fuel in the tank. The only way forward is to walk on foot. So do we control people, or do we kind of like RTS it? Before we go on, let's review the basics. Don't get trapped. Keep moving. Left click to select someone. Right click to move. He will automatically shoot zombies. Weapon affects your attack and range. Zombies will walk away if they did not see you. However, don't allow too many of them to pass you or you'll be sieged. Got it? I hope you are ready. Let's go. Okay, so can I like select all of you guys and then move you down here? down here. And now we'll move you up here. And now we'll move you guys down here. Down here. Look at that. Look at that. Flawless. So now we can go ahead and search some of these things. I right, so you can build things. I want to go ahead and search these. And search this. Okay, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll select you. You're going to go down here and you're going to search this. We're going to select you. You're going to go search this. We're going to select you. You're going to search this. And we're going to select you. You are going to search this. Look at all these resources we're getting. You're going to go over here and you're going to search this. You're going to come up here and you're going to search that. Look at all this. Man. I don't even think we were told to do that. But I have I have mastered this game. So the shinies are the things that you want to investigate. Okay. Cool. Start the battle. You know what? I'm unperturbed. You guys will not defeat me. You know what? You do not have enough resources to build. If you're feeling brave enough, you can call the zombie horde early. You'll get bonus ammo for that. Be careful, those zombies can overwhelm you. Searchable objects will sparkle. Yeah, I learned that. Don't even worry about it. We'll call. We'll call it. It was like a wave simulator thing. Or a uh, uh, tower defense kind of thing, too. Which is kind of neat. Okay, so we have 66 ammo stuff. Can't call it early. Give me the, give me the ammo. And these will get used to build uh, probably this one up here. So they seem to largely be coming up in this direction mostly. You go build something right up here, okay? You go build something right up. Okay, we do not have enough to uh, to do that right now check out those sandbags with turret parts I think we can build gun turrets there yeah and one more thing the military left some of their equipment you can call in support through the radio try building a turret and call for support for cover sure thing boss you are going to investigate this you are going to investigate this and you are going to go build this turret a little bit dangerous, but uh, you're gonna go search this. Oh dear! You'll 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 survive. You'll survive, right? You won't survive. That's also cool. Um, let's go ahead and revive you. See if we can make it. You're gonna retreat. Okay, go ahead and search her. Search your body. You retreat. You retreat back here. And uh, once these guys are gone, we're gonna go ahead and build this guy right here as well. Uh, you're gonna go up here and be kind of like the final defense up here. Also, the guy that reloads this thing. That thing's got to be reloaded, obviously. Okay, go ahead and reload this. 
Reloading the turret. That's right. That's what I like to see. Wasted a bunch of ammo, I guess. We wasted some ammo. We lost, uh, we lost a girl. So be it. <laughs> I'm not sure we found a weapon or not, but, um, <laughs> okay. Woof woof. I'm glad you made it. My name is Scott. I'm the one on the radio, and this is my friend, Shira the Samoyed. Samoyed? I don't know how to pronounce this dog, but it's cute. Welcome to my safe house headquarters. Woof. I hate to tell you this, but I have some bad news. Radio broadcast said today they are sealing off the mainland. We only have 20 days before they nuke the whole city. We need to find a way out before the 20 days deadline ends. As you can see, my legs are injured. I need your help gathering supplies and working around the headquarters. I'll be monitoring the radio. If we can fix this car, we might be able to use it to get out of the city. We should start working on it immediately. Hey, I think we can use the tools from the workshop to work on upgrades and repairs. Should we start on working on projects? Come visit me at the workshop. You're everywhere, yo. You sure your legs are broken? Last but not least, this is the mission briefing area. This is where we plan our night expeditions. I know it sounds weird going out at night, but it's actually safer as zombies are less aggressive when it's dark. We'll meet here when the sun sets to plan our first expedition. I've only got three people because I died in the dumbest way. How could I have died in such a... I just let her sit there and die. Like, I feel I feel bad. You know? Yeah, let's go ahead and... So I've got... Uh, yeah, so we, we get to move around now so, as, as much as we want. So let's go up... Uh, investigate what all the stuff is. You, we need to get somebody clean in the bathroom in here. Uh, we got a radio. We're gonna go ahead and hop on the radio. Recruitment call. Send out a radio broadcast to call survivors to join us. We do not have the resources necessary. We can craft new weapons and gear here in the workshop. You need to assign people to work on the projects. More people means faster work. Please choose a project. Which one should it be? Craft 9 volt batteries. Yeah, we definitely need that. We do not have a generator. Study basic weapons. Study basic gears. Turret upgrade. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and select this. Now assign someone to work on the projects. More people needs faster work. That's what I'm talking about. We're gonna add Delta. You're gonna be assigned. Uh, Mike, you're assigned as well. Con man, you're not getting assigned there. Okay, instead we're gonna go down over here to the garden. We're gonna plant where we go wrong ingredients for the kitchen, you can cultivate vegetables and stuff, yeah. I'm assuming this takes a worker as well. We're going to go ahead and plant uh, some vegetables. Vegetables are an important part of the progress. You need to assign someone. Of course we do. Con men, get on it. Okay? Nice and easy there, okay? Now this garage, we got to fix it as well, but we do not have the supplies. We can fix it, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look, I'm, I'm done the tutorial. We do not have supplies to fix it. I was completely expecting that. I don't, I don't have, no. So this takes, like, real time, then. And you want to go in the, at night. So we're going to go ahead and uh, take a mission. Fast forward to night time and start the expedition. Not quite yet, hey. So we can, uh, so it's kind of like a faction building simulator thing as well here. Just kind of cool. It'd be nice if we had, you know, one more person. Feels a little bad, but hey, you know. Slightly tired, you're getting tired, that's okay. We're gonna go ahead and fast forward to nighttime. Maybe there's uh, something about uh, like making them go to sleep or something like that too. I don't know, man. But the mission briefing area is where we plan our next expedition. We can set up to four people. It's better not to go alone. We need to decide who we should assign on this expedition mission. Everybody is going on a mission. We do not have a choice. You're all tired. Look. Rest. Do you want to skip the night and rest in HQ? Yeah, I don't want them to. I don't want to send them out when they're tired. Someone forgot to turn off the generator last night. I was running all night and wasted a lot of fuel. Oh, crud! Yeah, we need to stock our supplies. We don't have supplies. We have like nothing. So we're gonna go ahead and fast forward tonight. We're gonna let these guys just rest and be unbothered. It feels pretty bad though. But we need. We need these people to be good to go, okay? The building in the middle is where we are right now. Your current position is marked with the red arrow. We need to explore and secure this area before we can go to other areas. Let's explore this area, okay? We'll go ahead and explore this area. Go take out all the zombies around us. You need to explore this area before we can go further. Yeah, you said that. Stay sharp. The area is crawling with zeds. 
Try to eliminate as many as possible. The more zombies you kill, the zo less you will encounter next time. To leave the area, send your team to the edge of the map. Press the leave button. Good luck. Okay, so it's like actually like exploring. That's pretty cool. Let's uh, kind of continue down this way. We're going to kind of just take this as we go here. One step at a time. Okay, we're going to kind of go around the outside, around the outside. Got to say it twice, in respect to, to Chef John. Let's consolidate our, our units here a little bit. And allow them to handle this wave of Zeds. We're at 25% to 75% exploration. Got the map down at the bottom there telling us how much we've explored. That's pretty good. Kind of take it around the outside here. There's lots of stuff to grab in the middle. I'm looking uh, to get some of that stuff, of course. We want to get all the shinies. The shinies are very important. Car tire, that's good. Car tire is a, is a piece of the puzzle that we that we need so badly. Look at that fresh water. You're gonna have to make it inside at some points. You're gonna have to make it inside and raid all of these zombies which have been spawning and slowly, slowly push our way in. We're gonna have to consolidate. We have to consolidate. Consolidate. Stay around the outside here. Continue moving. All right, we have to move. Uh, we have to start moving inwards. I don't know if we have a healing way or like any kind of healing like bandages or something like that, you know? Can we get some more accurate boys here, please? Alright, we're going inside. We are inside. Get inside more. We have to have the tank at the front. Okay. Yeah, this is what I this is what I like to see right here. Take him out. All right. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. We got to, we got a boy up there. He he's not he's not going for us. We don't need to worry about him. Got another boy coming. There we go. Taken out. Efficiency. Do not know how to get around this area, but we have located new stuff. Look, you guys have to keep on moving. Keep on, keep, keep it, keep it moving. Keep it moving, okay? We got more boys coming from behind. You have to move up. These guys are hurting. Okay, can I have you uh, search this? You search this. Look at all these supplies we're getting. You get up there. Go and attack him. All right. In in we no wait. We're gonna we're gonna send you in first. You go in first. You guys follow in afterwards. Okay. Look at this. Okay. You're gonna stand guard right uh, here. You're gonna go down here. You're gonna you're gonna search that. You're gonna go ahead and search this. Okay. You're gonna move in. You move down. You guys. Follow down. Okay? We're moving as one group. Re revive my boy. Revive. You guys get. Okay? Revive my boy. Is he gonna make it or we did, did we just lose another, another man? You get down there. Take him out. Take him out. It's a little bit scary, but we've got a we've got a god tier unit in this uh, in this fire axe man. It's a little bit it's a little bit concerning, but we're getting resources, we're getting stuff. Well, buddy, I got a job for you. 
get in there and take him out. You need a break? That's great. That's great. Take a break while you search this. You guys, move up a little bit closer to your tank. <laughs> you guys are all hurting a little bit? You guys are faster than the man with the fire axe? I, I get it, the fire axe is heavy. But you guys gotta slow down a little bit, okay? Here, you get over here. I'm, I'm unscared. Take out the zombies. We're gonna head down. Back. You get in there. Oh yeah, got that critical. You see that critical? Alright, you guys are in here. You're gonna investigate this. You, you're gonna go ahead and investigate this. You guy, you're just gonna stand right here. You're gonna go down here and you're gonna investigate this. You're gonna get all these resources, all this ammunition. Supplies that we desperately need. We have explored 89% of this area. There's some area down here that we have not yet explored. We're gonna get 100% on this. I'm telling you. We're gonna consolidate our units. Consolidate the group. This guy's a little bit slow. He's not a very quick man. I think we've taken care of all of the enemies. But uh, we are going to consolidate once more. I think we've taken care of the, all the enemies, so I don't... Honestly, I don't care. I don't, I don't think there are any zombies remaining. I do not believe there to be any zombies remaining. There is still one unexplored room here. I'm confident. We gotta get, so we gotta get out over here. The music is tense. The music is highly tense. And I don't think it's necessary right now. I uh, hear, get uh, get this space explored as well. Where do we need to go? We need to go down to the south uh, southeast down here. Oh, we also have to get over here. We should explore all of this. That's good. It's 97%. We're almost done. Look, this is a this is a spot that we can't walk. I understand this. Okay, 98%. A little bit right there, and a little bit right up above us. No, wait, get right into the corner, please. Our old man here, the calm man, he's he's got some some pep in his step there, you know. He's a, he's a quick man. Okay, we got 1% remaining. Where's the 1%? Right up there. We'll head up there, and then we will leave the area. And that will be our explored... I mean, you'd think there wouldn't be that many zombies in the area directly around where we are right now, but, I mean, hey, what do I know? I don't live in a zombie apocalypse, you know? Do you live in a zombie apocalypse? I don't, and if you do, I would appreciate you telling me so that I can be aware ahead of time before it gets over here. Where's the remaining 1%, huh? Where's the remaining 1%? What do you mean there's there's 1% remaining? I don't, I don't buy it. I don't, I don't buy it. I've, I've explored everything. Okay. What do, you, what do you mean? I don't see anything. Yeah, there's no unexplored areas, right? There's, there's gonna be like one dot, and it's gonna be in this gray stuff. Yeah, right up here. Two dots right there. Okay, so we step up here. We step over here. Look at that, 100%. Boom. 100% exploration of the area directly around our location. I had to stand here to make sure there's nothing, you know, in, in that thing or whatever. I don't know, man. We have explored everything. We are leaving. Yeah, I'm sure I want to leave. This is a 100% explored location. We have completed it. Good job. 
Once an area is explored, adjacent areas will be unlocked. You can move to another area by selecting it and press the Go button. Selecting an area will also open the information window. To end your expedition, you must return to the headquarters. We are returning to the headquarters. We're, 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 we're returning to the headquarters. We need to rest. We need to start getting some supplies, starting to get some food going. We need to... There are things we need. And we're not going to make it in 20 days. Yeah, there we go. These guys are starting to heal. Alright, boys. We're going to add a survivor. Delta, you look pretty good. You're going on there. Okay. We got to get somebody planting some food. Okay, Mike. I'm sorry. You're on there. You guy. I mean, you don't, you don't, we don't really have anything for you to do. We cannot do this. We cannot do that. We cannot do that. We cannot do that. There's not an awful lot for you to do. We're going to head up here. We can see if we can make something in the kitchen. It's good to finally see you in the kitchen. Are you ready for your first cooking lesson? This is where we process raw ingredients into edible food supplies for our group to eat. Assign a few people to the kitchen and choose a cooking project to start producing food. We do have some supplies. We are going to... Uh, we do not have veggies or meats. Kitchen upgrade. Expedition ration. Yeah, go ahead and do this, okay? We're gonna assign the old man, the calm man on there, okay? What do you, what do you got going on? Squad. Oh, they got level ups. Oh, sick. You need speed. <laughs> Like, straight up, you need speed, boy. Confirm. I need you at the front when we're moving. Okay? Um, you, you also get a level up. I want you to have, uh... If we can get your aim to 100%, that feels pretty good. You also need to get some aim up, boy. I want to heal you. Use one supply and try to heal John Straw... <laughs> Strad Wick. Get the D and the W in the right place there. Super, super important. We're using five supplies a day. We currently have three supplies. I'm not a mathematician. We're gonna die. It's just the way it's just the way the cookie crumbles. Now we did lose a man early, and uh, that was m deeply unfortunate. But um. If we do another expedition, it's going to take us well past the time limit that I have for today. So unfortunately, we're going to have to end it here. This game is a lot of fun. Honestly, this game is is super fun. I can definitely see myself coming back and playing this more. I could definitely see this making a uh, making its way onto the YouTube channel at some point. This is a fun game. I like this game. It's kind of got some like x commie elements to it sort of and then uh like some rts and then some like base building stuff um yes it's a fun game it's super super fun it's it feels good to play honestly um the music is also kind of a bop although a little bit too tense for me not that i'm getting like tensed up by it but i'm just like it's not really a tense situation <laughs> I mean, it is, because we got like 20 days to finish to escape the city or whatever, but like, I don't know. Um, anyway, that is going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. I wish we could see this garden project finish, actually. I want to see what we get from this. Finish up the garden, boy. Collected two vegetables. That's all I needed. Okay, go ahead and get some basic fruits going as well. Yeah, have fun. Go, go crazy, okay? Anyway. That's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.